Vera Wang Love Struck makes me long for the dynamic zest of Vera Wang Princess. And not to hit you over the head with heavy handed sarcasm, but anyone who's seen my Vera Wang Princess review knows that I didn't think Princess was exactly exploding with personality. I mean, the thing about Vera Wang Love Struck is that it's just so vague. It's just vaguely grapefruity and then it's a little maybe oh I think that's a flower that I saw passing by and then it's kind of aquatic and the only thing Lovestruck isn't vague about is that it is clean 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 it's like cleaning product clean now I get that not everyone wants to wear some kind of big statement perfume you know like ah, manifesto smell some people just want to smell pretty. They just want to have a delicate, refined fragrance that you can only smell when you get close to them. And, and I, I approve, I approve that message. I think that's great. However, with Lovestruck, it doesn't actually smell like a perfume to me. It, it really does smell more like a functional fragrance that would be in a carpet cleaner or a dog shampoo or just something to signal that the thing has been recently cleaned. So, I mean, I guess if you want to signal that you've been recently cleaned, you could wear Vera Wang Lovestruck. Sorry. I'm Katie Puckrick and I smell. Number five.